Hi, my name is Leanne Hinion, and I am the author of Night Magic, Adventures Among Glowworms, Moon Gardens, and Other Marvels of the Dark. And I'm here to talk about the Turn Off the Lights Challenge, which I hope you will accept. While it's upsetting that light pollution is something we don't think about too often, and when we do start to recognize it as habitat, we realize that it's habitat that is dwindling. But the good news is, we can do something about it pretty much immediately and have a positive effect. Are there some porch lights that you could turn off more often? Are there porch lights that you could put on a timer or a motion sensor? There are certain fixtures that keep light in specific spots rather than creating light trespass. And Dark Sky International is an organization that has a lot of resources to explain those choices and to help you make decisions that might reduce light pollution. This book is really my personal journey to appreciate natural darkness in an age of increasing artificial light. It was partially inspired by a story I wrote for the Washington Post magazine about synchronous fireflies. I was expecting the fireflies to be amazing. What I didn't expect was how restorative and wonderful it was to spend time in natural darkness. When that story ran, a lot of readers reached out to me and they said that the story inspired them to turn off their own porch lights, which blew my mind. And I don't think that they reached out because I've talked about how light pollution is harmful for firefly populations, which it is, or because I talked about how light pollution is disruptive for pretty much every life form on earth, which it is. I think that they just got excited and curious about what might be out there. No matter how well you know the daylit world around you, at night there is something new to be discovered. 